The more we know God's name personally, the more our relationship with him will grow spiritually. The more we know God's name personally, the more we will grow spiritually. When you give your life to this one pursuit, one priority, one goal of pursuing God and knowing him through his name and his attributes, he will reveal more and more and more of his presence because his presence is found in his name. Remember, what comes to mind when you think about God is the most important thing about you. If I asked you the question, if, you were, if, you, if I was Owen and you or me, and we were sitting at Texas High, I said, who is God? What comes into your mind now? Could be the most important thing about you. What comes to mind when you think about God is the most important thing about you. Therefore, you need to ask yourself, what are you pursuing? Do you really want to know God? Not just know about God, like I know some facts and figures about God, but do you really want to know God? And if the answer is yes, then here's what you do. And this is the close of my sermon. It's very simple. You do exactly what Moses did. You ask. Please, God, show me your glory. And then you position yourself, you posture yourself in a way that allows God to speak. You, you, you pray, you, you, you read, and as you read, you pray, and as you read, you ask God to reveal himself to you, and the more and more you know about him, the more he'll reveal himself to you, and the more you know about him and his presence in your life, the more you'll grow spiritually as a result.